Hey everyone, Caroline Roberts here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to be talking about how important is physical attraction in godly marriage and relationships. So if you're interested in watching more, then definitely stay tuned. I want to start this video by saying there is more to attraction than physical attraction. You can be attracted to someone physically, but you can also be attracted to someone intellectually. So maybe you like this person's ideas. Maybe they have really good ideas and thought processes and a great mindset and you're attracted to them intellectually. Or you can be attracted to someone emotionally. So maybe this is someone that makes you feel comfortable. Maybe this is someone that makes you feel safe, like you can share what you're going through with them. Them. They're very supportive. So there are different types of attraction. Now, I'm making this video because women ask me all the time, Caroline, would God make me be in a relationship with someone who I'm not attracted to? Or do I have to end up getting married to someone I'm not really interested in? And my answer to that question is, sis, God created physical attraction. God created sex. God does not want you to settle. God wants to give you his best and that is his best for you. Now, physical attraction is variable. Maybe one person is physically attracted to one person, but someone else wouldn't be physically attracted to that same person. But attraction does matter, and God is the one who created attraction, and he created it for a purpose. But I believe that where we get lost is sometimes when we're looking for a relationship, some of us only base you know, our qualifications for a spouse on how they look physically. And I can say this, guys, because I've been there and done that. In middle school, in high school, I wasn't interested in intellectual attraction. I wasn't interested in spirituality or making sure that the person I was with was equally yoked with me. I wasn't interested in those things. I was pretty shallow and I was just focused on how the person looked and did I think that we can make good looking babies together. But when you grow and you mature as a person, when you grow and you mature in your walk, you realize that physical attraction does play a role Physical attraction is important, but there is more to making a relationship work and a relationship last than just simply physical attraction alone. God himself says that man looks at the outward appearance, but he looks at the heart. So if we are supposed to reflect God's image, if we are supposed to model his character, then we ourselves are not only supposed to consider the physical or outward image of people or judge people how they look on the outside, but to consider the heart and the character of a person. So don't just get married to a man because he has a six pack and he looks the way you want him to look. He has the type of hair that you want your kids to have. Can this man be a father to your children? Can this man really lead your family? Does this man have godly character? Does this man remind you of Jesus? And I can be honest, at some point in my life, I didn't think it was possible. I didn't think that God could give me someone who reflected the character of Jesus, but at the same time be someone that I was attracted to. And that was a lack of faith. Sometimes we have this lack of faith mentality, but now I know after being married to my husband for almost seven years now, and literally him being the most attractive man in the world to me, but also being an awesome man of God and you know a faithful husband and amazing father, God showed me that it is possible for me and many other women as well. There's so many other good guys out there. I'm tired of hearing people say, oh, there's no good guys out there. There's no one available for me. If God desires for you to get married and if you trust him with your relationship status, you trust him with your life, 
I guarantee that he will work something out for you according to his will. So I just wanted to do this video to encourage you that of course God doesn't want you to settle. He's not going to force you to be in a relationship with anybody. If you are really not attracted to someone, then you don't have to be in a relationship with them. But don't only look at physical attraction. Attraction can grow in many different areas. Attraction can grow over time. So if someone has good enough character, if he's a nice enough man, then maybe you can give him a chance and maybe the attraction will grow. I've heard of many couples who've gotten married and at first the wife was like, oh, he was hollering at me, but I wasn't even really interested in him. But they started off a friendship and it blossomed into something greater and she grew to fall in love with him and she grew to grow attracted to him and vice versa. So maybe that might be your story. And if it is, that's completely fine. Everyone's love story and everyone's journey is different. So I hope that you found this video helpful. If you did, leave it a thumbs up. And if it's your first time on my channel, do not forget to subscribe. Until next time, bye.